everyone, I'm Jessie from Nailed NZ and today I'm doing my third 5 in 5 nail art tutorial. This one has a blue theme as you can see and in case you haven't seen the other videos like this, the whole plan is to teach you 5 different nail art designs in 5 minutes. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up button and thanks for watching. As always, start off with a base coat to protect the natural nail and then we'll move on to the art. So we're beginning with the easiest nail and just painted the index finger with two coats of white. Next I'm using my dotting tool for my very own brush set that will be for sale very very soon. Um, it's covered in glitter right now but I don't see that as a bad thing. Anyway, so we're using that to dot on a row of dark blue dots followed by a row of light blue dots just above it. Easy. This next nail was meant to be a cupcake and then an ice cream and I ended up kind of deciding it was one of those frozen coke floats or whatever kind of drink you can think of with ice cream on top. As you can see I've painted light blue on the lower half of the nail and done a couple of coats. Next I'm using the detail brush from the Nailed NZ brush kit and making vertical lines in the medium blue. Once that's done use some white polish to trace on the shape of the ice cream and then fill it in. Following on from that, use a black polish to outline the swirls of the ice cream. Try to make it as natural looking as you can, but this part can be a little bit tricky. If any lines are a bit thick like one of mine, you can always go back in afterwards and fix them up with the white. Right, so this last part is optional, but I chose to add a straw after playing around with sprinkles and cherries and failing miserably. To do this, just outline the little straw in black, fill it with white, and then add a few dashes of yellow. The next nail is relatively easy but looks quite striking. Paint it with two coats of medium blue polish, the ones I've used are listed down below, and then make three black lines, two short and one long one in the very middle of the nail. Link the lines up with diagonal lines and fill them in until you have three black triangles at the top of your nail. Now we're moving to the bottom of the nail and you're basically going to turn this into a large zigzag pattern making more triangles and filling them in. Now grab some white and use just a little bit of this to make a few tiny triangles within the first ones. Again, you can fix up any mistakes by using other colours to hide them. The pinky is a design I've done many times but I felt I should do it again for this blue theme. Paint the nail light blue and then use white in the detail brush to paint on a bunch of really small lines coming out from a central point. Repeat this daisy pattern across the nail. Once that's done, use a yellow to make a little dot in each daisy's centre. The thumb is kind of cutesy, a blue summer's day. Paint on two coats of blue polish and once that's dried use a white polish and your detail brush to paint on some fluffy clouds. I did three but it depends on how wide and long your nail is. Add a little round circle popping out from a cloud, this will be the sun, and paint some rays around it. Once that's dry use some yellow to fill in the sun. Almost done now, just mix some white with a little bit of black and use this grey to make rough outlines and shapes in the clouds. Clean up any polish that's made its way onto your skin with a clean up brush and then apply a top coat. And that's it! I hope you liked watching this latest 5 in 5 design and let me know what colour you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon. Two of these prizes are my own brand, my own thing that I am giving away and I have created my own line of